So here we are. Hey, what's up? What are you inside? Yeah, sure. What a shitty neighborhood. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, well, here we go, guys. I'm going to show you my new apartment. And I'm going to um, guide you guys through this thing. So when you walk inside over here, we got one big closet. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this yet. Might make it a coat place, place to put jackets, place to put shoes every time you walk in and out. You guys are going to see when you go upstairs, there's a lot of space, a lot of closets in here. So right when you guys walk inside, you guys are going to see it's just a straight upstairs staircase. I'm trying not to fall on the ground. We still got a lot of stuff to do around here, but I've been working really hard with my dad who's holding the camera. What's up, guys? I'm probably going to put like a nice mirror right over here. And let's, let's go over here to the main part of the house. All right, so this is like the entire floor over here. We got the kitchen, okay? We got the refrigerator. Check this out. Look at all of those water bottles. They look like giant bullets just attacking you. It looks like Iron Man's like shooting little torpedoes out at you or something. It's really <laughs> sick. Got a Brita filter, major key. Uh, V8 Splash Tropical Blend. Love this stuff. I'm not paid by these guys to say this is really good. It tastes delicious. A lot of sugar, but it tastes really good. Propel water, another major key. This is actually not bad for you at all, and it tastes like good water. Is that green tea I see there? What are you talking about? Oh, yeah, green tea. What, do you got a shit? Yeah, I got to take a shit. So <laughs> green tea. But we also have actual green tea that we can make because we got a curing machine over here. So we hooked this place up from head to toe. Everything in here is top of the line. Green tea, hot chocolate for those cold winter nights when you don't want to snuggle with me. We got some, I guess, coffee, pike roast. Pike Place Roast, ground coffee, hazelnut, donut. We got all kinds of coffee in here. <laughs> the knife set. <laughs> we, got, we got Michael Myers knife over here, okay? <laughs> this thing is actually really cool because, Dad, come closer. These knives, when you put them inside of these holes, they actually sharpen themselves. So that's really sick. These are like some steak knives over here. And we got some scissors. So like if I need to open anything or cut anything, we got scissors. Hopefully, uh, you're not just gonna get too mad at me one day and then uses that against me. Microwave, okay. Stove, oven. This garbage is a garbage I had for like a couple of days as a temporary one. I'm probably gonna give this to my mom. My dad actually just installed one right over here. Like one of those sliding ones. We got this from Home Depot, so that's pretty nice. We got a drawer here with some stuff. We got some measuring cups. All the batteries I'll ever need in my entire life. We got a can opener. I don't know why I have this can opener because I have an electronic one right over here. There's like another side draw where we could like spin and we have a lot of Tupperwares and stuff over here which is really cool. Some mixing bowls for baking because I like to do a lot of baking. I like making brownies and cookies and all that good stuff. We got some oven mitts. We got a second set of kitchen towels. So we have this black and white one over here. We got this one as well. Over here is where we have all the baking stuff. So I have all my baking pans. And then I got a mixer uh, that I bought. Cuisinart, really good brand, Bed Bath & Beyond. It's actually pretty expensive. I was gonna say it's cheap. All this stuff is pretty high end. I mean, it's just a mixer, but it's really good. So this is the cabinet where I am gonna be eating a lot of junk food, okay? Best chocolate chip cookies you could buy on the market. Tate's chocolate chip, you get them from Costco, it's $10 for a bag. If I was like a 10, 15 year old kid right now and I saw this in my pantry, I'd be freaking out. We got some regular fruit rolls my mom hooked me up with, five or one brownies. We got some pop secret movie style butter. We got the chocolate chip cookies. We can make them homemade if we wanted to. And then my mom got me some more chocolate stuff. I don't know why she's putting this in my house. We got Hershey's chocolate, M&M's, Chips Deluxe, rainbow chocolate chip cookies. Are you serious? And then we got all these cereals. So we got Cinnamon Toast Crunch in here. We got Reese's Puffs in this one. And then we got Cheerios in this one if you want to go a little bit healthier. I like mini wheats, so once I finish these up, I'm probably gonna get some mini wheats. Empty. Absolutely nothing in this cabinet. <laughs> and as you guys can see, I have so much room that I don't know what to do with everything. Um, I got another mixing bowl, I got a whisk. I got a liquid measuring cup. Oh shit. I got some wooden spoons if I want to mix things. You guys know I like to bake. Yannette's probably gonna be cooking a lot when she's here, so. Uh, I want to fill everything up. As you guys see, I have so much room in all these cabinets. I don't even know like what this to do with half of this stuff. Here's another cabinet. Here. Okay, so so far I have black peppercorn, uh, black peppers, and sea salt. And I have like another grinder. I have some little spices. These are my china, my plates I got from Bed Bath and Beyond. I think these are dope. So it's like a coffee cup if I want to use it in the morning. Then we got a giant plate that matches it. I got actually eight of these plates. Smaller plates and bowls. These are actually really freaking cool. These are the things you guys are gonna appreciate once you move out of your house and you start looking to buy an apartment or buy new things. 
And then I have the salt and pepper shakers because these things are automatic. Check this out. We're going to go over the, where should we go? Garbage? Sink. Go over the sink. Okay, guys, look at this. Come over here on the other side of the counter, Dad. Ready? Look at the thing really closely. Three, two, one. There's a salt. You see that? Do it again. One, two, three. You might be able to see it. And then we got the pepper. <laughs> How sick is that? You totally don't need it, but it's cool. <laughs> and then when you're done with them, you actually just put them back on this stand and they recharge themselves. So the battery basically never runs out and that's how you know it's charging. So that's really sick. Got some cooking stuff. I don't even know what happened. This is, this is a spoon. I got a spatula. I got all this other stuff. I got like a drying mat that's actually reversible. So it's black on this side and tan on this side if you feel a little bit crazy. Pots and pans. These are the really expensive pots and pans I got. As you guys saw in the uh, video, I think these are like, what? A few hundred dollars or something. Mm -hmm. The good thing about buying expensive things is that these things are gonna last you a really long time. So I could use these for like at least another five years of my life. And even if I move, I'll have everything that I need. Sounds like you got delivery. All right, so the kitchen's done. We're gonna move our way over to the dining room, living room area. So we got this countertop. I'm actually getting like two um, like stools I'm gonna be putting over bar here. Bar stools? Yeah, like bar stools. I'm gonna be putting those over here to eat like some breakfast in the morning if you want. Um, this is the dining room over here. I really love this dining room set. Come closer, Dad. So these are like some really nice hard chairs. Feel really solid. Table right here, so if anyone wants to come, we got a chandelier over here. Then we got these little mats that we put on the table, which match really nice. We went really, uh, we went really hard on all this stuff, Dad. We really checked it all <laughs> Actually, out. you and Arlene did. Arlene, yeah, Arlene did too, and so did you. A lot of people helped out, this wasn't just me. Um, I got these Sono surround sound systems. PC Richard's coming tomorrow. They're getting like these stands, so when I want to watch the TV, if you turn the camera over to the living room, I'm gonna have like the best top of the line Sonos surround sound system throughout the whole house. So for like every football Sunday, I'm gonna have like the speakers in the back blasted. I'm gonna have like two in the front over here, or just that one. And then we got the bar. We got the 65 inch Samsung 9000. Let's go check it out. So uh, like I said, this is the Samsung 9065 and I just love saying it. I just wanted to say it. Super so, UHD, Super 4K. Super UHD, 4K. Over here, you flick this on and the fireplace should go on. Let me flick that on. There it goes. There you go. There's the fire. So um, we also bought like a bar set. So I'm gonna be putting a bar set like right over here. So whenever I have my friends over, we're gonna have like a little place where we can make drinks and do whatever. Um, Christmas tree is gonna go over here. Maybe get like a mirror or like a big, big painting in that corner. He's like nice glass tables from Raymore and Flanagan. This is like the only thing we got from there, but I think these look so sick. We got this really nice couch from Lazy Boy. Like this is an all leather from top to bottom, back and everything, reclining couch, and it is so comfortable. So for anyone who wants to come over, if you guys like this video, you're welcome to stay at my place, watch some football in my crib, and just relax and enjoy yourself. All right, so I was told not to show off anything because this is a private gated community. Like they don't want me to like, having people come over here and like trying to get through the gate but this is like my balcony area it's like pretty big i could put like a small little grill out here and like some two chairs and i got a little electric outlet so if you want to charge your iphone 7 or whatever down here you got it so you need a tv out here no, <laughs> get the samsung 9000 <laughs> uh, so just to give you guys some perspective i think the ceiling over here is like i want to say that's like 20 feet all the way to the top right yeah, probably. Yeah, so I don't know, like on cameras, things look a lot smaller. Like the TV probably looks smaller than what it is. Um, everything might look a little bit smaller, but it's actually really, really roomy and it feels nice. Now we're going to make our way over to this other area of the house. We got another closet over here. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. I'm sure I'm going to find something for it. We got another walk-in closet over here, which is like a little bit bigger than the one downstairs. I still don't know what I'm going to do with this, but we got a lot of space, a lot of room in here. <laughs> And I'm the only person living here, so <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with all this. I'm going to have to have a lot of people over. Washer and dryer over here. We got the Verizon Fios up here. We got some pods over here. I don't know what all this stuff is. Got some bleach pods. Um, I got an ironing board, an iron, and then some fabric softeners. Okay, now we're going to make our way to the other half of the house. So this is the pantry, which is actually really sick. Come inside, check it out. The lights are a little bit dim right now, but we got napkins, hot chocolate for the Keurig, green tea, coffee, Ziploc bags, big bags, small bags, sandwich bags, wrap. We got the little bites, party muffins, okay. I want all of you kids that are in school right now, 
I didn't have this when I was growing up. I was so jealous because my mom never bought these and all the other kids in the school would have like the little bites or like the cosmic brownies with like little sprinkles in them. And I had like nothing. I had like some cheese doodles in a plastic bag and I was so jealous, but I wanted to buy one of these as like a housewarming thing because I don't know, I think these are dope. So this is the guest bathroom over here. So if you check it out, we got uh, the sink, we got an automatic soap dispenser. Check it out one more time, look. Automatic soap dispenser right here. Just like that, boom. Wash your hands. I hate where the toilet paper roll is in there. <laughs> Why? You can't reach it. What's wrong with the toilet paper, Dad? It's you gotta twist yourself like like yoga or something be, to get to it. It'd be nice for the lefties though. So. Why don't you show them? Check it out. It's a pain in the neck. Look how so close it is. If you want to take a dump, you got the bathroom over here and the toilet paper it's, right over there. You hit it with your elbow for Christ's sake. <laughs> <laughs> this is the shower. We got some nice shampoo and conditioner. Um, here, check this out. So we got. I bought these marble garbages for the bathroom and I got like a little plastic bag around it which is dope. Alright, then we also have like a marble soap holder I guess. So it came with the garbage, the soap holder. That's crooked. What? The right, left side's high and the right side. Oh, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Are you fucking with me? <laughs> Are you fucking with me? <laughs> Dude! <laughs> was it crooked? It was crooked though. though. Alright, so right outside of the bathroom is like a little towel rack. We got some uh... Linen closet. Linen closet, we got some Turkish towels over here. White, brown, nothing too crazy. Some sheets because this is where the office is going to be. So as you guys tell, there's nothing in here yet. If you guys want to see like a gaming setup video, then just drop a like on this or comment. But basically I have a really cool desk, which is the top, this is the top of the desk right here. You guys can't see it's in a box. That's going to go over here. I got a printer that's going to go on the desk, which is in the closet, which needs to get set up tomorrow when PC Richards comes here. And we're going to basically put the desk right over here. We got this over here. There's like a little file cabinet to put taxes and all that other boring stuff. This is to make sure the chair doesn't slide anywhere. We're gonna get a nice big couch that pulls out to a Tempur-Pedic bed. That's probably gonna go right here. We got a little stand that's gonna go over here like that. And it has like a fireplace in it. And then we got a mounted TV on the wall that's gonna go right over there where this cable box is. Um, computer's gonna be there. Bed's gonna be over there. We're gonna have some sheets, some extra stuff. And we got some space over here. I'll probably take the YouTube plaque, put it up on the wall somewhere. Frame the phase jerseys, and then this office will look really sick. And we're gonna move on to the master bedroom now. So this is the master bedroom. We still got a lot of work to do in here too, as you guys see. I got my clothes on the floor. We're watching some tennis over here. This is the Samsung 9000, 55 inch with the Sonos bar. We got a whole bed set that matches this. We got a big dresser that's gonna go here with the mirror. Then we're gonna have a small dresser, or I guess a, a, just a tall one, on this corner at the, the room over here. Then we got a bed table, like a nightstand on both sides of the bed. And then we also got a bigger fireplace that's gonna go right here. It's like this long. You guys are gonna see, it's gonna be so sick. When I do the updated gaming setup video, I'll probably do the fireplaces too. That's gonna be where the cable box goes. And then we have the bathroom. So let's check this out. So this is the bathroom, it's pretty simple. We got our sink. Um, this is the marble garbage right here. And then it comes with this little toothpaste thing, or like a toothbrush thing. So I got a toothbrush holder here. I know you guys have commented about my eye right now, so um, we got the cream for that. Here's the bathroom, the toilet, my little hamper, and then the shower over here. And that's, uh, yeah, that's basically everything. So guys, that's my entire apartment tour. Like I said, I still have a lot of work to do. I'm putting in a lot of work to this place, and it's not just me. My dad's girlfriend, Arlene's helping me a lot. My mom, my sister, my dad, all the movies that are involved in this. Like, it's been a long, long process. A lot of money spent, but it's a big investment. It's something that's gonna have to happen eventually in life. Um, I knew I was gonna have to move out, and I'm really grateful that I could afford all these things. And again, that becomes, that's all because you guys watch my videos every day, and you guys support me. So I wanted to say from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys so much for all of this. This is only possible because of you guys watching these videos. So I'd really appreciate it if you guys dropped a thumbs up on it, and comment down below what you guys think of it. Think what you guys think of the entire place. Is it nice? Is it is it whatever? It's literally like right next to my mom's house, which is really cool. And uh, it's still like right near the face ass, it's still in New York. So I got everything here that I need. I got my friends, my family, my gym, and I'm happy with it. So that's all that matters to me. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Please smash the thumbs up button, comment down below, subscribe if you guys are new, and it's been your boy Doug Sensor Martin, and I'm out guys. Peace.